What's up, you guys? Your boy Shader in the building, and I want to welcome you to another edition of Is It Real? The show. Before you go, you ask Shado. That's right. I'm never going to steer you wrong. And tonight's feature film is 21 Bridges. Yes. With Chadwick Boseman. You know, Black Panther. <laughs> and not in this movie. He plays a, I guess, a second gen cop detective, I should say, um, on a hunt to find some people that just m murdered about eight police officers. And the plot thickens as the pieces of the puzzle starts to come together and unfold, and the movie gets really crazy. Now, this movie is really cool, and it's really good, and it also had a lot of reminders to me. This movie, if you've seen The Negotiator, it reminded me of that. Just more look up to date and way more action. You know what I'm saying? It was heavy with the action, which I love. The action in this was really great and phenomenal. Tyler Kish played a major part in that. Um, and he was in the you know, American Assassin and John Carter and a slew of other movies and also Battleship. But he did a really good job along with his uh, PIC, partner in crime, uh, Stephen James who played a really pivotal role in this movie as well. And then we got J.K. Simmons. Yes, he's in his, you know, man himself from Counterpart. And also he was in Terminator Genesis. So it was a lot of things going on in this movie. A lot of characters, a lot of pieces to try to put together and find out what's really going on in this movie. Now, the dialogue and the script writing in this movie was on point. It was really good and carefully thought out. The way they had it and the way they had the actors combat each other verbally in the dialogue with the push and the give, it made it excellent to watch. Because I love when movies have combative dialogue amongst other characters and actors in the movie, which really paints the picture on how intense everything was and what was going on. Um, the CGI, of course, it was some of that in there. But that wasn't the vocal point in this movie. You really get hooked into the dialogue and the action. The action in this movie was crazy and phenomenal, by the way. Very tactical look and feel and vibe. And also kind of like you're right in the fight of what's going on. You're, you're running around. You're losing your breath. It's crazy. The movie really draws and brings you in and gets you, you know, thinking about like, oh, my goodness, what are these guys going through? And you can really feel those moments of intensity. Now this movie right here, I'm gonna go ahead and give this movie a shark. It's really good. You will like this movie, you'll enjoy it. Cause like I said, it, it, it reminds me a lot of The Negotiator um, with Samuel Jackson and uh, Kevin Spacey, except just more up to beat and way more action, which is beefed up. And so, I, and I love The Negotiator. That movie is definitely a shark. And so I think you will like 21 Bridges for sure. So yeah, go out and see this movie. All right, you guys, let's keep it moving because I got some oldies but goldies. And today's first oldie but goldie is The Professional. Yes. Which one? And Natalie Portman. This was a really good movie. And Gary Oldman. This guy does not disappoint in anything he's in. I mean, seriously. Just, just such a great film. This movie has pretty much started Natalie Portman's career. I got to gotta believe because she was a young girl in this movie but this movie is phenomenal definitely worth checking out and my second one godfather the whole series because you just can't have one you got to see them all so godfather please watch this a perfect movie to be watching going into the holidays have some time off watch the godfather especially if you've never seen it you will enjoy it I do thank you for tuning in for another edition of Is It Real? The show before you go, you come at Shay Doe. And until then, I will see you guys at the movies. So peace.